Earlier in the year, we took a look at the flagship WD Black SN 750 SSD, and it's fair to say it's one of the best drives out there if you want the fastest speeds available. But of course, that does also mean that it has a price tag to match, so it's probably not representative of something that most of us would buy. So if you want to maximize value while still getting the increases in speed that NVMe brings, what do you buy? Well, this is where this comes in. It's the new WD Blue SN 550 SSD. WD Blues offer a much better gigabyte per pound ratio than the black variants while still maintaining much higher speeds than the traditional SATA SSDs. There have been several improvements over the previous SN500 models that should hopefully make the SN550 one of the more desirable mid-range drives. Let's take a quick look at the specs and then see how the new drive performs. First up is the capacity. Whilst the SM500 is only available up to 500 gigabytes, the new SM550 doubles that up to one terabyte. Speeds also increase to 2,400 megabytes per second read from the previous 1,700, and write speeds are up to 1,950 megabytes from 1,450. IOPS performance jumps significantly too, and perhaps even more importantly, the endurance doubles to 600 terabytes written, double that of the old drive and most of the competition in this space. Warranty remains at five years, which is great for peace of mind. So the specs look very good, but how does that all look once we throw in a few real world tests? Let's take a look. In Crystal Dismart 6, we can see that the maximum performance claims are correct. If anything, they were slightly exceeded with 2,032 megabytes per second achieved in the right test versus a 1,950 megabyte specification. It's a big jump up on the previous model, the SN500, but naturally the SN750 is another step up again. On to our real world tests. First up, our 32 gigabyte video file copy. It took just 31 seconds to complete on the new SM550, holding around 850 megabytes per second average after the cache had filled up. This compares with 36 seconds and around 745 megabytes per second on the older SN500. The flagship SN750 managed just 19 seconds, holding 1.5 gigabytes per second. Next up was our game copy, 60 gigabytes of Metro Exodus files. This took just 1 minute 32 seconds to complete, which is a serious upgrade if you're running a SATA-based SSD right now. That compares to the old model SN500 at 1 minute 41 seconds and the black SN750 taking just 49 seconds. So there you go, some great results from the WD SN550 range. Prices are £50 for 250 gigabytes, £70 for 500 gigabytes, and 125 for the one terabyte option. You can get yours now at scan.co.uk.